What's up guys, it is Tyreek Hill here, AKA the Cheetah, also known as the fastest man in the NFL. And today I got a behind the scenes footage with none other than my boy Luther Glover. Now, you guys know Luther as one of the best trainers in the Overland Park area. He's about to tell you guys about some of my favorite things to do after a long Sunday football game. So Luther, could you please let him know what we do? So what we do with this guy when he's not being a knucklehead is we do, we do, we do a lot of unilateral you know, movements. He's already, he's in season, so we don't want to like overstress him and and to do stuff too draining on his body. But we want to make make sure he has a good workout, work on a lot of stability, balance, a lot of uh, unilateral, whether it's single arm, single leg movements, and a lot of uh, pre injury and pre rehab stuff. So that's usually what we do. Try to get in at least two or three days a week and take take a look at what we do. Hey. You guys, hey, one, like I said, if, if you live in the Kansas City metro area, Overland Park area, Lee Summit area, anywhere in the Missouri or Kansas State line, this is one of the best trainers to go to, man. I'm telling you, I've been coming to him since I've known the guy, since 2017. Look at me. Uh, just look at this body, man. Body by Luther Glover, David Glover, if you're watching this, you too, man. Hey, leave a like, subscribe, coming to this video. Zev, you know, you know what to do. We out, man. Enjoy the, enjoy the video. Yes, sir, Zev. Perfect. So you're gonna start with single leg RDLs on an unstable surface. You're gonna go, you're gonna go six each leg. 25, 25. 25s. Where they at? Oh, they right here, booby. Huh? Yeah. Get you some like 20s or 15s. Single leg. Oh! Ah! Nah, no music, no music, no music. I'm good, I'm good. Ah! What's right here? As soon as we get done with that, ban RDLs. So you're gonna weight it to a uh, band. We'll get you a, a red band. Go like this. No, 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 go like this. Dealing with the camera. You got to. So you want those two, and then hollow holds. You want to do abs in there too? Each circuit with abs? Or you want to go all legs? So here, you want to hold here, lateral lunge off, and then come back up, six each leg. So the reason why you're doing it off this, so you know you're stopping and cutting, Yep. And you're coming off, get a little, deep, little bit deeper. And you're gonna start over from the top. Everything is six each leg, three sets. Good. Tighten up your core. Keep your chest up. Arch your back. We want everything single leg. Yes, sir. 
A lot of people don't do unilateral stuff. Try to grab it at the very bottom. You get more resistance. You don't need that much. <laughs> I'm making sure you ain't. I'm making sure you hey. feel that shit though. That's all. I feel it. All right, cool. I feel it. Shit, I don't want to have you make sure you ain't feeling. I want you to make sure you feeling that shit. Oh. Remember, everything is six. Oh. Ooh. Hey. If you haven't liked this video yet, I'm gonna take a five second break just for you to do that. Also coming. Hey, everything you're gonna do is single leg, just so you know that. Alright. So you got two more circuits, everything single leg. You gotta tell me the shit you can't do with your hamstring. So it's the same thing to step up, but you jump. So you go here. No, no. Be explosive. Huh? Buddy, you better you better get loosened up for that uh for that girl from yesterday. That what I'm saying, you gotta come over here and do the You gonna put these on your ankle, and you gonna tap front, lateral, and then back. Five each side. So it works your adductors, your balance stability. Five each side. Chest up, and you gonna go like this. Five. Uh. You should feel that. Try to keep all your weight on your heel. Zip, you tired? You hungry? All right, it's coming. It's coming. It's a coming, boy. So when you get here, when you get here, you're gonna open up your hip like this. But don't, don't touch the ground, neither one. Don't touch the ground? Okay, I won't touch the ground, buddy. 
What? No, I didn't. I didn't. I didn't touch the ground. Yeah. Oh. Hey, open up your hip when you don't go back and forth. Like you go here, turn and open up. Rotate your hip. Yeah. Then go all the way back. Like that, yeah. And squat more. Yeah. Go up. Stop right there. Shift your hip like that. If you want to feel it here. Then go. Shit, I already do feel it right now. Yeah, <laughs> you feel it? Yeah, yeah. I ain't trying to hurt you because I don't know how bad your hamstring is because. You go like this. You lean forward. You'll feel it more. Rotate. And stand back up. So RDL. So you go to RDL. Open up. My son, he said, my daddy can do that really. RDL. Open up. Open up as you're going into the RDL. So you're going here, you turn. Yeah, like that. Then bring that hip all the way out. Rotate it all the way out like this. Like you about to smash from the side. Yeah, like that. There you go. Look at Grandpa chilling. <laughs> I'm gonna try to put that down. Hey, don't go so fast with this. Like, these ain't fast exercises. Cause you wanna feel in your groin, your, your adductors. You feel that? Ooh, don't, don't, that's gonna hurt the hammy. Look, uh, lean a little bit more forward before you turn. Yeah, there you go. Man, that's the body of a got the body of a goddess. You tell me to call your name, my, my name is Cheetah.